Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Uh, in the previous video we got some villagers over to the breeder and for whatever reason they just didn't want to breed. Uh, they kept falling out of this little cell. But now it appears to be working. They're in there. He's throwing carrots for them. They're try they're throwing them back and forth to each other. And yeah. They are work they are working hard making some babies. And if we go over here to where I want to build like the trading hall area and you can hear them down here uh, the best way to go if I go down here Oops, too far and there they are so you've already got three so just block that up so nothing can get in or out and then head back up now I want to I'm going to build a structure of some sort around here and we can start getting some bit of just to trade with and then getting some villagers for an iron farm so I'm going to crack on with this and I'll catch you all in a little while uh, welcome back everyone we have this all set up for now for the first one uh, it does work I'm just going to give it another little test run just to be on the safe side we coming on a minecart. Perfect. Now we just need to get a minecart back. So, ideally, it will continue running around until we get until it gets to the end. Uh, let's just get back up here. Now let's get drop down and get pushed back in. So that's that set up. So that's one. Uh, I thought I'd put it here because I didn't know. I can't put one that side because of where the rail is. So I was going to block that up. I'm not going to make it all out of cobblestone. Uh, the plan is to use acacia for the floor and then it's just a little design like this well, obviously with no windows on either side and I want to use a smooth stone as well so I am going to build a few more of these because I don't have that many resources the one thing about it is I've had to go to the nether to get some quartz because it uses obsidian obsidian nether quartz so I don't have that much left I've got observers so I've only got five observers and I want to use smooth stone as well in this as I said and I need to get a lot of pistons as well so I'm going to crack on with this and I shall hopefully bring you back when I've got at least this floor in because when I'm done there's only going to have room room for about five or six on either side so that's be one more two three four five and we'll do the second we'll, on the other side 
and then I don't know whether to go up or go down I one of the two but I think you can push village up in a minecart through a bubble elevator so I'm going to have to look into that but then yeah I'll, uh, I'm going to crack on with this, get this done, and I'll bring you back when it's done. Well, I said I was going to bring you back when I'd finished, but I've run out of resources. So this you've got, you've got so far. So we've got uh, is it six, one, two, three, four, five. Yes, yeah, six cells at the moment. Uh, let's just get over here. Ooh, I fell down. Right, everything is all set up and wired up. Let's try that again. Everything's all set up and wired up. I need to get some more pistons. Because obviously, these aren't going to work. Uh, but that is everything so I've got to extend that side over a bit quite a bit actually get some more acacia wood so that means lopping down all of these and then hopefully can we get onto there so here's where the track ends. I'm going to bring it around here, bring it back up one block so it runs across this part here and then round so we've got the exact same on the opposite side. And then I think we go up take it up another floor and then because I want to fill this one with all librarians and then we can have the next floor up we can, we can have a few toolsmiths uh, the armourers weaponsmiths that kind of thing and then I think if we go one below after that so once it comes round here and gets to this point it'll just drop down uh, onto another right onto another track uh, so we can have the same setup so we should have 6 12 that's like 24 in total uh, spaces and I'm going to change the exterior of the building once I've got this up and these filled in so I'm going to do some more resource gathering and I'll catch up with you in a little while right welcome back um, we've got the majority of it done now and I've rerouted where the villagers come up and uh, I just sleep through the night and we can take a look I did have two did plan on having two entries, entrances either side but instead we'll just have the one in the middle come on let me sleep there we go right I haven't put the tracks down yet but I'm going to route them back across here then up then they can carry on up across and then carry on that way instead so all that's left to do now is to just fill up the areas around so there's no they can't escape 
and then I so said that's pretty much that done then. I've already done that. That's right in the tip. So I'm uh, just trying to do these just from copying this side. So now it's going to fill all these in. Uh, I'm not going to be able to bring any villagers over in this episode, I don't think. I just want to get this layer done and then a ceiling on top because I want to build another uh, level above. But, fell down a hole. But this is where we've got to so far. So I also want to take this out, and so we can get more centralised. So we've got one on the back. We'll have one this side. This will be where the villagers go across, isn't it? Oh, they may have to put one more. So, you know, if I do it across here, it's just going to look a bit silly. Oh, we'll figure this out at a later date when we get actually into the finishing it, making it look a bit better. So let's just fill that back in for now. And so this will be like a little storage area for a couple of chests. I'm going to turn those into stair blocks so we can open them. But yes, um, I'm going to continue doing a little bit of work and hopefully we should be able to get it done very, very soon. Right, welcome back everyone. These are all done now and I've started work on the second floor. But I thought, let's just get rid of this stuff out of my inventory actually with I'm not sure if there is string on all of these ones. Yep. Yep. Well, it looks like there is, yeah. So I thought we'd give it a bit of a test on camera. So at the moment I've only got one space because I've only got the one flower pot so I need to go and get some clay but I thought we could give this just a quick run so I've wired up a button to request a villager it just may take some time so let See if we can hear a minecart rolling. It does sound like it. Oh, it's a long way, it's a nervous wait. Do they appear to have got stuck? Well, there's an empty minecart there. 
that's never a good sign is it and there is another minecart in the system so let's try it once more signal's getting there but it's not picking them up let me just put these back in oh thank you for the carrots and we just Why is it not picking them up? That's got to be facing down, hasn't it? Oh, well. Um, give me a moment and uh, see if I can rectify this. Right, I believe the problem is now fixed. So let's go and put this minecart back. And I have a feeling we're going to have to sleep through the night again before we can get some wick. So I have to kill these off to put a rail in there, so this one will go up to it. Because for some, I've, I'm sure I've done it before, but apparently I hadn't, or it had got, or I'd done something different and it had moved. So. Where's that little baby? It's all right down there. Oh, can't get through that way. It's now night time again. Which means I'm going to be taking a beating of all the mobs. back and we can run 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 let's see if we can sleep up here this time yes perfect all oh, right Water, creeper, so you can blow up in the water, you won't do anything there. I need to get a bow. Or at least get knocked back on the sword. Let me jump. Ugh. Caught me completely unaware then. Right. Now, let's try this again. Actually, we need to wait so there's until there's villagers. Uh, in the system I think there may be one in there no 
now. Doesn't look like it. Uh, right. Um, seeing as we're next to a swamp, plenty of clay, so I'm going to uh, get a load of clay. And hopefully, when we come back, there will be plenty, well, some, at least one, villagers waiting. So I'll bring you back in a little while. Right, we are back. Hopefully now everything is all working. I'll just put a, these flower pots in. Well, that's all of those now. Let's press the button and wait. And while we're waiting, we'll just drop these in. I could do with some trap tools just to pull along the top. And while we're waiting, we can do that. doesn't seem to be working alright let's go down and see if there was any villagers there because that's going to be the key thing Mine cards come out, but it doesn't look like. Mm. Let's try again. Now they need to be adults by the looks of it. Oh, so let's just quickly wait for them to become for him to become an adult. I wish there was a way you could speed up the growth of the villagers. We've got two in there, we just need him to grow up, so I'll bring you back when he has. Right, he's grown up. So, let's head back on over to the breeder. Well, not the breeder, the trading hall. And let's try again. Right. Now hopefully we should get one coming through. Why is it not picked him up? Oh well, we'll um, try again in the next episode, but I am afraid I'm out of time for this episode. So, if you have enjoyed this episode, please do leave a like, and if you really enjoyed it, 
make sure to hit that subscribe button. And I shall catch you all in the next video. Goodbye.